Now that we understand how crude oil and natural gas is formed, let's discuss how it migrates and is trapped. After natural gas and crude oil is formed, they tend to migrate upward to the Earth's surface because they are lighter or less dense than water. Simply put, migration is the movement of natural gas, a vapor, or crude oil, a liquid, between the Earth's porous rock formations. The porous rocks, such as sandstone or limestone, contain hair-sized spaces that can hold natural gas, crude oil, and water like a sponge. The ability of liquids and vapors to migrate through the porous rock is called permeability. Where possible, the molecules will climb vertically between the rocks. The speed of migration depends on the permeability of each rock formation that allows the flow of these vapors and fluids to move upward. Trapping takes place when the migrating fluids and vapors reach a non-permeable layer of rock and cannot migrate any further. These trapped molecules slowly begin to accumulate within the porous rock formations forming a reservoir. Using advanced technology, the natural gas and crude oil industry will then use various exploration methods in search of these reservoir locations. There you have it. A brief explanation on the migration and trapping of crude oil and natural gas. With continued research and development, we will be able to produce the safest, cleanest, and most efficient natural energy all across Ohio. For more information, follow the roadmap to video series Exit 3, highlighting the exploration of crude oil and natural gas.